Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. I'm Sasha and this is Just For You Paper Crafts. So today I have a Timu haul for you. Uh, first things first, see this little offending sequins piece here? So the notorious little black spider. Now I'm not a lover of spiders um, at all, okay? Um, as long as they don't crawl on me come near me they are free to live their life just don't come near me but this little sequin obviously i've been crafting i've been doing some uh halloween crafting and sequins and this little little one obviously was had landed somewhere on, on me and it was on my foot and it wasn't until i was indoors and i noticed it on my foot i instinctively screamed kicked my foot out I then stepped back, I stepped on the dog, the dog shouted and as he had moved I kind of stepped back again, tripped over him and fell flat on the floor. All because of this. So tell me, who else has had the same issues with these little devils? Honestly, for a sequence it caused a lot of hassle. But that was my story. So let's uh, let's get into what we have today. So I'm just going to start with some oddsy things that I have. Um, and then we can uh, go through all the exciting stuff as well. Uh, right. So I'm going to start with I bought this little packet and they're they are they're safety pins. Not like the safety pins in my last haul, if you watch that, the little plastic things. <laughs> These are pins. Comes in a lovely little container. I mean, initially, they're clothing pins. Okay, so you get different amounts. So basically, that's what it is there. And it unclips like that. So they're like clothing pins. So you get that style let me just zoom you in so you can have a proper look so you get that style you get an absolute abundance but i thought they're so great for adding to projects um what else have we got so let's do these bigger ones here you've got this one you've got the smaller ones i love that red so you've got these smaller ones. There's another big one there. Some more smaller ones. Then you've got these bigger ones with the very pretty beads on. So you've got that one there. And you've got one, a blue one. Very, very pretty. And then you've got, I'm not quite sure what this one is. Oh yeah, so it just opens up like that. So I believe they're for putting across, you know, if you've got a low cut top or something like that. These are great if you have a top that's just slightly bit wide at the, the waist and you just want to nip it in a little bit um these are great so you kind of just undo the ball thread it through and clip the ball in and not only is it just gathered in the sides of your garment you've also got a, a very pretty piece there as well and you've got another one similar there and You've got another pearly one there, another one similar to that one, you've got another large garment pin, you've got another one of these, which is very pretty with that love heart stone in there, how pretty is that? And then you've just got, they're like little badges. Let me just show you. I'm just getting them out of the pot. So you get a little black flower. So they these are just, oh, let's try and do this. These little clip-in pins. 
yeah so you've got a black one little black flower you've got a little white rabbit and a little pearl but I just thought how lovely and you've got quite an abundance in this little box how sweet would they be to just add to projects I really liked it so I thought I would share that with you now I've got to try and get them all back in there we go they are in So next I have, oh, I just bought these pins because I've got a bit of an issue with one of my glue things. I'm actually, while I'm here, I'm just going to try it. I'm just trying to find something thin enough to, and strong enough to go into, oh, there we go. And yes, there we go. We now have glue. I don't know. They can sit in there now. Look at that. I don't know if these are stainless steel or not. Um, I'm hoping they don't rust. Let's just have a look. No, it doesn't say. But you get 50 of them and I've just got some butterflies and I've got just different colours. But that was predominantly what I wanted them for because I was having an issue with that uh, blue bottle. But now I don't, which I'm really pleased about. Um, I bought these little plastic garment pins so they're just just little plastic ones and they clip if I turn it around and they just clip in there how cute are they they're really cute and they've just got an absolute abundance of different colors I don't know how many I've got in there I'll have to have a look And I can't get them back in. <laughs> Let's have a look. See how many we get. 50 pieces. So you get 50 of those. Quite cute. Um, then I bought these little strawberry clasps and I have desperately been trying to get the pink ones and all the other colours but they keep selling out so fast um, so I've just got the white ones and you get two, four, th five in a pack but how cute are they? Little strawberry clasps so you've got a swivel bit here and here is your opening so you just press that in and close it but they're really cute little strawberry clasps i've not seen those before but i really do want to get the other colors right next up oh i just got some um round-headed pins that was all I don't know how many I've got in there 50 so you get 50 of those um I bought uh I think I've got 60 they they come in packs of 20 and I bought three packs I've just put them in this bigger pack but I just uh, beaded chains and there's just uh, an array of different colours in there. Because I was looking for a colour the other day and I thought, well, I've got pink and I've got gold. But I didn't have anything else. And I think it was a yellow I was looking for or a black. I can't remember. But anyway, so I, I thought I need to I need to get some more. So I got three packs and then just put them all in here. Uh, I just did buy some yellow jump rings. That's all they are. I get, uh, I don't know how many I get in there. I think there's about 50 in there actually. Um, yeah, so I just got some yellow ones because I was looking for a yellow ball chain and also looking for yellow jump rings. I had neither. <laughs> and I couldn't understand it. I couldn't understand it at all. So I bought these little Christmas trees. I don't know why. If you're doing a shadow box or something like that, how cute would they be? So I just bought them in the cream. 
and they've got a little snow effect on there how sweet are they and you've got a little wooden base but just tiny little brush christmas trees they're really really cute um how many did i get in there 12 so i got 12 of those in there and next up um what did i get in here let's open it up oh i think actually this may be magnet so i always get the round magnets but i saw these and i thought oh i quite like them quite like the look of those so look at the so they're flat oblong ones i quite like that I don't know how many I get in a pack. Ten pieces. Two, four, six, eight, ten. Oh, I got an extra one. I got eleven. <laughs> so just ordinary, but uh, ordinary magnets, but um, oblong and really thin, which I really like that. So they can sit in there before everything gets attached to them. <laughs> And next I got was this trim. So let's just let's just open this one up. So it's a leaf trim. And it really did have the Maggie Holmes vibe, honestly, with the, the pink, the, the green and the gold. But look how pretty this is. So, so pretty. You've got the creamy white colour there. I just really liked it. And how much do we get? So you get one yard of this. You get quite a lot. You know, I must admit, you do get quite a lot. But I really did like that. I liked it a lot and it's really thick as well and I've just screwed it up and about to throw it in the bag I'm not going to screw it up actually let me just fold it properly because it won't go in the bag else so let's just get put that in there <laughs> she says <laughs> get in right and the next piece of trim I bought, if I can open it up, was a bow trim. Now, I liked this because, realistically, you could cut this down. I mean, you get a lot here. How much do you get? doesn't actually tell me, but it's crystal. They call it crystal bows. But look how pretty this is. I mean that's a that's a big bow. That is a big bow. And it's double layered. You've got a little pearly bit in the middle there. And it's a trim. But you could just cut it straight down the middle and just have yourself one piece. And I mean, that's enough for anything, isn't it? But that is lovely. I really liked that. So I got that. Um, next thing I got was, oh, I was, I got this die and I was going to make it, but I've totally forgot all about it, but I will do because I'm doing some die making projects as we speak, but this is so cute and I don't know if you're going to be able to make it out. So this is a baking tray and then you've got a little gingerbread face there and there's his eyes and everything else to go there and then he's got a pillow and it's a layered pillow he's got his little blanket and it's like he's a little he's asleep on the baking tray <laughs> that amused me so I'm going to leave that out because that is going to be one of the uh, ones I make that I want to to show 
I know I said a while ago that I had a little surprise for you. I'm still working on it. <laughs> I am still working on it. So there was that one. Um, so then they did this pack of 50 surprise dies. Let me just have a sip of coffee. So you get, you don't know what you're going to get. So let's just have a look. And some you'll use, some you won't. So let's just see if we can. Are we zoomed in or out? No, we're out. We need to come back in. So we've got a rabbit. We've got different types of leaf flower foliage. Let's get all of these pieces out if I can find them. Oh, there's another piece there, some flowers, more flowers, let's move that one, let's get some organ uh, order here. Right, so that's almost the, oh, another kind of leafy bit there, so that's that kind of uh, designs that we have. Then we've got some animals. So we've got an owl, we've got a duck, got a rabbit, another rabbit, got a butterfly, we have another swan. I would you say that's a swan because of his little beak there. It's a duck swan. Yeah, we'll go with that. We've got an elephant. Uh, we've got a couple of rabbits in clothing. We've got a rabbit kind of in a frame. If anybody knows what that is, just let me know because I have no idea. I have no idea what that looks like at all. No, it's not making any sense to me. I don't know if it does to you. And I think this is supposed to be a cow. So that's all the animal kind of kingdom. And then with the oddsies, we've got uh, a little dancer. I've got a scarecrow. We've got a little drummer, we've got an axe, got a little car, I'm not sure what that is supposed to be, I'm not sure at all, got a little witch's broom, a little butterfly clip and whatever that's supposed to be. So there we go, that's what we got. So you never know, you know, you might be thinking, oh, I, need, I wish I had that type of die or that type of die. They're small enough just to add as a, a little embellishment somewhere, but um, I, I did quite like that witch's broom, actually. I did like that a lot. <laughs> so those were the dies. So to go with these dies, I bought these magnetic sheets and pouches so what I was thinking which is what they're for anyway it's for the dies um, see there's your metal sheet there so if I was to get some of these Make sure I got it on the right way round. No, I didn't think I did. There we go. So they stick well. So you could just add. And then you won't lose them all. And 
just going to add a few here. Let's put an elephant there, a little duck. I don't know how many I'd be able to get on here, actually. So we've got the broom, a little pin. So I can leave it out for the minute. And then you've got these envelopes, plastic envelopes. Just a Velcro closure. And then these just slide in there. Close it up. Oh, I think actually I might put it the other way around. Honestly, if I close this and they all fall down to the bottom. <laughs> I hope they don't. I hope it does what it's supposed to do. So you just close that, close it up, and there you have your dies. Like that. I like that a lot. They're great for the bigger dies as well. Because I have storage for my smaller ones. But I quite liked that for the bigger ones. I'm just going to open my window because I have got very warm all of a sudden. And it hasn't been the nicest today, I have to say. Um, so I got these stickers. Which I thought were really cute for gifts happy mail anything like that so let me show you so warning opening this package will cause extreme happiness there you go how many do we get let me have a look did you get 120 of these stickers and they all come in a nice on a nice flat sheet as well instead of on a roll and they're pink but I liked those. So we have those. Um, right, so I bought a couple of paper pads. Only the small six by six pads. So I'll quickly run through them with you. Sorry, my coffee's going cold. Right, so this one is called Joyful Days. Let me just zoom in. So joyful day. So let me just uh, show you the papers quickly. So you got this one. It's got uh, ice cream, um, luggage, camper van, donut, sweet treats, aeroplane. That is a neck cushion, not a toilet seat, if any of you were thinking that. <laughs> Right, so it's it's only single sided. So you get how many sheets do you get of each? So you get two sheets of each. Oh, look at these lovely little cut aparts that you have here. Really, really cute. Then you've got stars. You've got this. Set. This is always a great um, design to have on a on the back of a project if you're um, kind of doing embellishments and things like that. There we got uh, spots. Oh, we got some more little tags. They're really, really cute. And some more cut aparts. How sweet are they? I like that one. Collect moments camera. Got polka dot. Got a fairground, just a worded sheet, and then we've almost got like a starburst sheet. So that's those, and that is called Joyful Days. So that's that one. The next one I have is, let's just open this one up. So 
So this one is called Sunshine. So this one's a really bright and it's uh, single sided. So you got the and you get two sheets, I believe. Let me just double check. Yep. Yeah. So you got the rainbows, multicolored hexagon, floral in the dark. Got a worded sheet. Different words. You're the best. You made my day. Make me happy. Enjoy your day. And you got this very pretty floral one. Then you got stripes, multicolored stripes. Stripes with love hearts. It's quite sweet. Grid paper. Ooh, and you've got this design. Polka dot. Polka dot again, but in stripes. And you got this one. And that's that. So that is the sunshine pad. The last one I bought of the paper pads was animal print. Because animal print is fun. Absolute fun. So this is called leopard print. And it's double sided. I love the fact that this one is double sided. So let me, how many sheets do we get of each design? I think it's two. Yes. So you've got this one. Got this one. I like this one. Got this one here. It's not the easiest, is it, showing paper pads? Got this one, funky multicolored. Another one. That one. Got that one. And this one, I quite like that one. I quite like them all actually. That one. Oh, I really like that one. I really like that one. And I also really like that one as well. And there we go. And like I said, they are double sided which is really, really good. So that is the leopard print. Uh, so next, I I bought three of these little, a kind of thin MDF. Let me just zoom out because I'm right up on your nose there. These little thin MDF, like chopping boards. But I got three of them because I thought how lovely they would be to be decorated. So whether kind of decorated it used it as a big clipboard you could put a pocket on the front there you could tuck in some goodies or you could put a big nice bulldog clip on there decorate it and add some um embellishments you could use this piece to kind of hang down a charm dangle and everything but i just really like them so i want to uh, i want to make some and see how they turn out you could paint them they're just i just love them i really like them. i like the size of them as well really really cute so we have those bit of an odd buy i know <laughs> so i bought this now i do like doing diamond painting i'm currently doing one at the moment i love to there are just times aren't there where you just want to sit down in front of the tv and do 
a little bit of crafting but something where you don't really have to think about it you can watch a film you can just put your feet up and and diamond painting is that for me that's what I like but I bought this one so I bought it because it had these bits in <laughs> but how cute are these so they're they're for the the kind of window charms if you like so they're bumblebees they're really really cute so you've got that one there and you've got that one there so you it comes with all the kind of diamond pieces but these are all jewels which are really nice you get <clears throat> excuse me you get the the uh, traditional kind of pen little um diamond dot boat and your little um kind of sticky wax piece to that you kind of stick your pen in and it picks up these little pieces here but because it's a window charm what it also came with was so it comes with two clasps let me zoom in a little bit so you've got two of these little clasps. You've got two ball chains and you've got a couple of um, jump rings. Now, all of this is gold. Them jump rings are silver. So, you know, I'm going to change them up for the gold ones. But then you get this little dangle, which I thought was really, really sweet. So you got like, and it's plastic. So you get this big plasticky crystal and all the other crystals that will catch the the sun as the sun comes through your window and all you do is you kind of attach everything and it hangs off the end of your diamond painting once you've done it but i thought how cute is that so you've got an opening at the top there one here so you kind of just however you're going to do it and then just you've got all the connections to be able to hang it but I just thought that was really sweet. I really did like that. And that's why I bought it. So there you go. But like I said, I do like diamond painting. I'm doing a lovely one at the moment. And I had oh, a beautiful one bought for me the other day. And it, I just loved it. Absolutely loved it. And I can't wait to start it. So let me just put all of this back in its bag. Yes, it was a lovely, lovely surprise that I had this. Uh, and it's a hairy cow, um, but it's got all flowers around the top of its head. And if it, oh, it's just, it's absolutely beautiful. I just love it. I was so happy when it was gifted to me. Right, so next thing is can't have a, a haul without any box and bags can we that wouldn't be right so i bought these <laughs> now i bought these and they kind of turned up and i was like why would i order those but you know we're here i did clearly so let me show you but they'll be all right you can always find a, a use So how many do we get? I don't think it says, and I can't remember off the top of my head. Let's have a look. One, one, two, three, four, five, six. Oh, do you know what? I'm counting this all wrong. One, <laughs> two, three, four, five, six seven eight nine ten right so you get ten and what they are are they're just they're just plastic bags that is it just ordinary plastic bags but with these bright yellow flowers how pretty so they are nice actually if you just want to pop some gifts in if you've got bigger items as well because you've got quite a wide gusset on the side here as well so they will open up 
up quite wide. I'm not going to open them fully. Um, and then you've got a thick white plastic handle. And, and they're quite nice size, to be honest. Um, but yeah, so that's what uh, I bought. <laughs> it's always such a surprise, isn't it? <laughs> It's always a surprise for me. I don't know about anything else. <laughs> right, so gift boxes because I love a good box. Right, so you get this one. You get two in a pack of these. And I did buy two colours. So you get the box. You get your ribbon. And you get your kind of little pearl handle. Um, I did buy them in the green as well. I'm not going to take it out, but I thought that was quite pretty. So I did make one. Of course I did. So how cute is this? How cute! Look at that little pearl handle. And you've got the ribbon for a little bow on the side. There's the side of it. There's the back. That's the bottom. And you just, the best for you, it says on there. And you just open it up. And look at the size of that in there. Always amazes me how much room you have in these really really does you could get a load of all sorts in there and then you just push it together and you've got a little opening in there so you just push that oh. push that in bring around your little bow and there you go really really sweet i really did like that i liked the pink and the gold but i also liked the green as well that dark sagey green so that was that one so the next box was this maroon one so you get the box you get the the bow detail so you get the actual bow and the bow tails and you get some brads and you get like this gold uh, rope as your handle. So before you ask, yes, I did buy it. I did make one. <laughs> so here it is. How sweet is that? It looks so regal, doesn't it? <laughs> so regal. So that's the front of it. It's the side. It's the bottom. And that's the back. So you could put any type of embellishment on there if you wished. And then a little closure, closure just opens up and you open it up that way. And how sweet is that? And you just close it, push the tab in and there you go. And there, and that's that little bow. I loved the colour. I love that deep maroony colour with the, with the gold. Really did like that with your little gold rope handle. So really cute. <laughs> I love a good box, I do. Love a good box. Right, next one is, oh, I liked this one as well. So this is like a book box. Okay, so this would be your cover. So that would be the rear cover. You've got your spine there and there's your front cover there. Um, you've got the internals of the, the book and you've got some ribbon. So uh, let me show you this. I really did like. Look at that. How sweet is that? You are my most favourite. Oh, Full of happiness, it says on the back there. You've got a little rose detail. So it says, start on a journey, you and me, sweet love, full of happiness. That is really cute. And on the ribbon, it does say, happy every day. How cute is that? So there's the box part. 
So all you do is you undo your ribbon and you just open it up and there's the inside of your box. Really cute. Really, really cute. And you just tie it back up. But how sweet would that if you just wanted to gift somebody some little chocolates, sweet treats or something like that. But really nice. So that is the book box. So the last box I bought was this one. So I love the colour of this one. So you, this is the box space. You've got some brads and you've got some uh, the plastic handle which says happy every day on there. So let me show you. I didn't tell you how many you get in a pack actually. One, two, three, four. So you get five in this pack. Let me just quickly run through them. You get five in the book pack. Two in those um, pink and green bags. And this one is five as well. Okay, so you get five. So let me show you this one. <gasps> How beautiful is that? And it says thank you on there. The best gift for you in that most beautiful Tiffany blue. So you've got an embossing detail. Can you see that? Let me just zoom in so you can have a proper look. So you've got that embossing detail on there with little flowers. And down the side. And also at the front there as well. And this one just opens up like that and there's the inside. And then you just tuck it on the inside and thread it through. But oh, really, really gorgeous. I absolutely love that. And honestly, it is. It's like a little, it's like a little blue Tiffany bag. <laughs> like it a lot. <laughs> <laughs> so there we go so there's that one and that is the end of the boxes and bags so let's get a little bit organized here and then we can get on to the more exciting stuff I'm just moving stuff out of the way right so next so I bought this, so let me just take it out of its bag. So this came as a set. So you got this little kind of a heart jar. It's got a little cork stopper. And in here you have, whoa, they're almost like, they are, they're little, pill capsules so what you do is let me get in frame take it apart I'm going to need my tweezers I think so you take it apart you take out the little roll and it's got a little gold ring on there so you take the little gold ring off and then what you can do is write your secret message or your little love message on there can you imagine popping that in somebody's pocket and they find it and they open it up and it says all nice kind lovely words on there or you can just put them in some happy mail. But I really, th I really liked the concept of it. I really did. I really did. So let me just try and put all of this back. So you roll it back up. You put your little gold ring on. Pop it back in your. Let's just move that one down a bit so it doesn't move too much. So put it back in your capsule. 
Well, this is easier said than done, isn't it? <laughs> right, I really want to put it back in its capsule. We're going to go back in its capsule. There. I knew I would win. So I'm just going to pop that back on. And I don't know if you can see it, but on each one, they all have a little heart detail on there. How sweet is that? So, but what you do is you get your pot that it's coming. And this is the other thing. You could just write loads of, almost loads of messages to yourself. Maybe, um, what am I trying to say? Like uh, inspirational thoughts. So you could do, I mean, it would take you forever, <laughs> but you could sit there and write all inspirational thoughts in there and each day you just pick one and that could be your inspirational thought for the day but how cute is that i really did like that so i got that one <laughs> so flat bags so i bought these um sequined um skull flat bags i can get into them these are really sweet and really sparkly as well actually how cute are they so they're just little flat backs but you could put a bale on there use it as a little dangle charm but they really do sparkle i don't think the camera picks it up that well actually but uh I did like those. How many do we get in a pack? I think uh, 40 pieces, possibly. Don't quote me. I could be absolutely wrong. Um, so I bought these flat back resin roses. So gold sparkly. I quite like those. And there are how many in a pack? Doesn't say. I think 20, though. I think they're about 20. Oh, these. Oh, you're going to like these. Flower centres. So, so pretty. Oh, look at them sparkle. Look at them sparkle. So let me give you a close-up. Look at that. How pretty. So you've got like a pearl there, got a little pink and white diamantes there. You've got that almost like opaque white one there. You've got a little flower. You've got some more sparkly jemmies in the centre there. But how pretty are they? Oh my. Look at them sparkle. But I really liked those and you get three, six, nine and you get ten. Ten in a pack. Really, really pretty. But I thought if you were making a flower or something, how nice they would look to go in the centre. Or a centre of a bow. Oh, delightful. Delightful. Come on, get back in. Um, oh, I didn't realise I bought these as well. So I got the um, skull flat backs, but I bought the mixture, coloured mixture. So you've got some nice bright yellows and blues and greens. You've got a couple of blacks in there, um, darker pinks and red. So that's a really fun mixture, actually. Really fun mixture. So you've got bits of those. So I bought these flower centres. So I bought um, a mixture. Let me get my new bowl. Let me show you. Da, da, da. My little spooky bowl. My little ghosty bowl. <laughs> I thought, right, it can come in handy right up until Halloween. Why not? So we've got these. Look how pretty they are. 
So let me show you close up. So we got an array of different colours. So let me just pick out a few. So you have a good idea. Oh, we've got some green ones. And then you can see what the colours look like. That's why I buy the mixed ones, because I like to see what the colours look like. That's what I like to do. I think that's all of them. So look how pretty they are. And they've got the little rhinestone diamantes going around the edge, and it's almost like a pearlescent pearly bead in the middle. But really, really pretty. And I love the different colours. I love that red. And the baby pink, bright pink, yellow, blue, white, purple, green and pale blue. So super, super sweet. Right, let's see how this is going to work. Oh, yeah, no, yeah, no. OK, it did. <laughs> So then I got these flat backs. She says, I got these flat backs. <laughs> these are very pretty. <gasps> oh, very, very pretty. So let me just show you. The different colours that we have. Oh, I do like the yellow, I like the pink, I like the blue, I like the green, I like the white, and the purpley blue, I believe that is. Yeah, I think there we are. Look how pretty they are. So you've got the yellow one there, and they got this iridescent almost changing colour about them. So you've got the pinky one there, the bluey purple one there, which is very pretty. You've got the green one, the white one, and this beautiful tealy aqua colour. But they're so pretty. And they're just flatbacks. So that is those. How many do we get in a pack with that? Do we know? Anybody know? 20 pieces. We've got 20. Yep. And now I can't get them back in. It's been a funny old day, you know, with the weather wise. This morning it was absolutely lashing down. Oh, lights flickering and everything not working properly. I was like, oh my. Right, so this one, what have we got here? Do you know what? I do like this one, but I do feel right now it is just a little bit too big. <laughs> so I'm going to revert back to my little pot. <laughs> I feel more comfortable. <laughs> so, oh, look at these. Oh, oh my. <gasps> They're so pretty. I could just dive right in there. Honestly, whatever next. Right, I'm just trying to get some colours out for you so you can have a look. Because they are just, they're just too pretty to, to not see them. I just want to make sure I've got all of them. And they are tiny, but they're great to add to small embellishments. Right, look how pretty they are. Look how sparkly they are. <gasps> So pretty. So that's a iridescent black. You've got purple. You've got the pinky colour, teal or aqua, white, that lovely bright yellow and green. How pretty are they? And they are just, again, ordinary flatbacks. 
but lovely to just add on to a small embellishment. Really, really pretty. How many do we get in there? A thousand. It doesn't say. But there's a lot. There is a lot. I mean, they're going to last for a long, long time, aren't they? Let's be honest. <laughs> right, what have we got next? Oh, so... <laughs> I bought these. More flat backs because we're on a flat back run at the moment. Look how pretty these are. Oh my, look, oh, look at the sparkle. <laughs> oh my dear, look at that. Oh, I'm in love. I am in love. Oh, they are just, they're stunning. Absolutely stunning. I'm just getting over excited now because they're just beautiful. <laughs> oh my, let me just get these for you so you can have a look at what all the fuss is about. Because <laughs> clearly you think I'm probably overreacting a little bit here, but look how. Oh, look at that sparkle. Look at that sparkle. Oh, they're just beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. I mean, look at that pink one. Just, oh, the sparkle that just dances. And this one. So you've got the beautiful aqua blue. You've got the pink. You've got the darker pink. You've got the yellow. I mean, that yellow is stunning and it's just not even showing its true colours here on camera. You've got the white. I mean, look at that. You've got the black. You've got the purple and you've got the deep red. But they're beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. And they are flat backs. But look how chunky they are. I don't know if you can see. Let me just see if I can get a better one. So can you see how chunky they are? Just absolutely beautiful. Oh, look at that. Changes colour. Oh, I'm obsessed. I'm obsessed. Put them away, girl. Come on. Can't spend the whole video looking at these. <laughs> Do it off camera where nobody can see you. <laughs> oh, dear me. I'm like a crazy person obsessed, honestly. <laughs> dear me. They are beautiful. I like those anyway, by the way. <laughs> right, so the next thing I have are these bow flat backs. Really pretty. I liked the pastel colours. I also liked the detail in there. So you've got, uh, got pale pink, darker pink, a lilac and a mint. And you've got a blue. And they've all got different colour little love hearts in the centers but they're really really sweet and they're just flat backs but i liked the ruffled detail in the actual bow as well that's more of a corally pink color actually but really pretty and you get 10 10 of those So I bought these and half of them are broke, but to be honest, I'm not bothered and I'll show you why. And to be honest, they're not broke, it's just the glue's come undone. Anyway, so these are little flowers and look at the centres of those. How pretty are they? So you've got these pearlescent beads here and you've got 
the little stems with little diamantes on them in this pearl flower finish and they're quite a nice size they are quite a nice size but they're very pretty however i got one two three four five that are fixed in place and the others, as you can see, this glob of glue there had obviously come away from the centre. But I'm not overly bothered. I'm not overly bothered because I think these would make very pretty uh, flower centres or bow centres. So I'm not unhappy at all. So I've got five that are full. And these I could use as something else. So I've got another, oh no, I've got another one there that's, sorry, that one's fixed as well. So these four aren't, which is fine. But even with these, you could um, add some brads and just attach it to um, an embellishment or something. So it all works. It all works fine. So as I said, I'm not unhappy at all. Where there's a will, there's a way. Right, so I bought this bag of resin. I'm going to say resin. Cabochons. Flowers, flat back flowers. And honestly, there's so many different ones. <laughs> So many different ones. So I'm going to show you a few. And they're just really pretty. I really liked them. I was not unhappy with this little pack whatsoever. I didn't know what to expect. But when it arrived, I was like, I quite like that. I mean, look at that one. How pretty is that? So with the bigger ones, let me just give you a quick look. So you got these. That one, I like this one. And I quite like this one as well. So you got those. Uh, what else have we got? And we got some smaller ones. I'll just give you a quick, a quick look. And then we got these. So they're quite pretty. And I'm not sure how many you get in a bag, actually. 20 pieces. You get 20 pieces in there. But that's a nice mixture, isn't it? A nice mixture. So the last of the flat backy things, I bought these puffy hearts. Very Maggie Holmes. But just some cute, puffy, puffy hearts in gold. I really liked those. And I got, how many did we get? Oh, it doesn't say. I think about 50. I'm sure something, somewhere lurking around in my memory warehouse, somebody shouting, there's 50, Sasha. <laughs> All right, all right, calm down. <laughs> so, anyway, there we go. Puppy love hearts. God, I'm going on again. Wittering on in my own little world. Right, so next thing we have are charms and beads. So I bought these. And I was a bit disappointed, I have to say. So they're little uh, jack-o'-lantern jingle bells. And they look nice, I have to say. They do look nice. They're a nice size. They do look nice. But listen to this. It's not very jingly, is it? It's not very... So I was a bit disappointed with that, but never mind. Apart from that, I do like them. So I got three of those because you buy them separately. 
Uh, then I bought this key chain, which I thought would look really nice as an embellishment on uh, hanging off a, a project or something. So you've got the pearlescent beads. You've got that lovely pearlescent bow up there. And you've got this round pink closure here. And this one just opens up like that let me just show you so it just opens up like that but i thought that was really really pretty i only got one <laughs> i don't know why so then i bought these beads when they first arrived i was like nope don't like them but then on closer inspection i was like oh i like those <laughs> I mean, they are very, very small, but they're different colours and they've got uh, almost like a, almost, they've got a, a kind of a gold paint, I would say, on the outsides of them. So let me just show you a few oh, different colours that we have. They are pretty. So you can see the gold around the edge of them and they kind of got different colors running through them so they are oh lost that one <laughs> let's bring him back in that one's almost got like it's got a yellow and green in there got red and it's almost got gold in there purple and blue or pink and blue really pretty they are they're very very pretty actually they're just very small small little beads and how many did we get why is it sometimes they print it on there and sometimes they don't i don't know i don't know how many's in there i'm not going to count them I could do a competition, couldn't I? Guess how many beads are in this packet? <laughs> uh, so the next beads I have are these large Christmas ones. So what have we got here? We've got hot chocolate, hot cocoa. How cute are they? I think that says hot cocoa or hot chocolate. My eyesight is deteriorating. Honestly, it is. I need to go to Specsavers and get them tested. So you've got that design. And you've got the one with the little cup on there with the little marshmallows in. How sweet is that? I do love a mug of hot chocolate, I do. <gasps> and then you've got another, it's like a little white mug, if you can see that, with some holly on there and marshmallows. Oh, I can't wait for Christmas. I love Christmas. Uh, what have we got here? Oh, so this is, if you can see, some mittens holding the mug. So if you was holding a mug like that, how cute is that yeah and that's the design so you get two four six and you get ten of those in there i keep threatening myself to put up the tree i don't know why i'm threatening myself i'm either going to do it or i won't <laughs> it's like sasha if you don't behave you're not allowed to put the tree up <laughs> well i'm gonna put the tree up whether you say so or not. <laughs> Problem is, I need to get it all down from the loft. Yeah. If I go up there, I'll never be seen again. Right, so what have we got here? Oh, these are very pretty. I love this style of love heart. So, pearlescent beaded hearts. So, I've got that. Look how pretty that is. And you've got the B 
bead at the top the uh, bead at the top there you've got the hole at the top and at the bottom so you've got these colors i mean it's a mixed color so you never know what you're going to get so i only got one pink one yellow but that's okay they are very pretty so you get two four six eight and you get ten of those Uh, <laughs> next we have they have two little umbrellas and when I say little I mean little so let me just take them out because I think these are bent over a little bit so I'm just going to straighten them out right so you've got these two <laughs> how cute are they <laughs> look at that with the little love hearts on them so you've got obviously you've got the little hook there to be able to hang them as a charm and then you've got the handle there with the little pearl on uh, this one needs to be straightened up a bit so I just need to get some pliers and I will do that which is fine I'm not bothered by that but, <laughs> I mean, that is cute, isn't it? They are so, so cute, these little umbrellas. <laughs> I did like them. I did laugh. So next I bought these little enamel flowers. I do like these. And I think, I really do think I've purchased them before. I think there may be a repurchase. I can't remember. You guys probably know more than I do. So you only get five, but look how pretty they are. And I got them in white. I am a lover of white, I have to say. But there we go. How pretty are they? So you've got the green in the leaves there and the white and the gold and that's the back of them so very pretty so as i said you only get five which is fine and then i got these little charms and you get five of these as well but these are very pretty and i'm absolutely convinced i bought these in the darker ones the other day <laughs> <laughs> but look how pretty they are i love the little pearl detail and the little flower on there and they're just that's the backs of them there so they're super cute next up we have oh these are pretty <laughs> these are pretty they're just little love hearts but look how pretty they are so you've got the little diamantes in the middle can you see that oh with the white enamel going around the edge and then the gold i mean that is just perfection really really pretty and you get three six and you get ten in a pack of those they do do them in other colours, but this on this occasion, I wanted them in white. Oh, so I bought these little mixed colours of gingies. <laughs> I think in my last haul you saw that I had the blue ones and a lilac or something. So now my mixed bag arrived. Look, <laughs> look how cute. <laughs> so we got our traditional gingerbread we've got a pink one we've got a purple we've got a blue and we've got a little black one but how cute are they so so sweet little colored ginger people 
and you get two, four, five, ten. You get ten of those, so you get two of each, two of each colour. There, there we go. I did like those. And I know in my last haul I had them, but I wanted the mixed colours. And I had to wait till they've rocked up on this one. <laughs> Uh, so then I bought these charms. These charms were not cheap, I have to say. And they came in a pack of two. Okay, and they are quite heavy. So I got these little ghosties with the uh, gold hearts. And they are hollow at the bottom. So I could stick my finger in there. And they are metal. And they are quite weighty. So I've got those two. And then I picked up white ones. So you've got the little gold heart. You've got little pearl there. And they're little purple eyes. But they are big. I mean, that fits on the end of my finger. <laughs> With my nail. <laughs> So I got two of those. But as I said, they were quite pricey. Considering you only got two of each. Uh, next I bought these little cupcakes. So just ordinary little cupcake charms. And I got them in the pink and in the mint. Well, that's what they came in actually. Pink and mint. How cute are they? Just tiny, tiny little charms. You get two, four, six, and you get ten in there. Then I bought these skull charms. Nope. Yep. I'll get them all out actually because there's different designs on the, each one of them. Definitely fun for Halloween. So there we go. I like that one. Got lots of fun there. All the different colours. And you get eight, eight of those. So that's those. Oh, I'm nearly coming to the end. Uh, then I bought these little pumpkins. These are really heavy. Honestly, they are really heavy. But this is a repurchase. I've bought these before. Two, four, six, eight, and you get ten. And they're just tiny, tiny little pumpkins. But they're just great for adding on to little charms. But as I said, they are heavy. They are weighty. I can hear Teddy shouting. Right, I bought these. <laughs> when they turned up, I was like, what on earth? Never mind. So they're little resin flatback charms. Different ghosties. <laughs> and some jack-o'-lanterns. Let me just move these up. So I bought them. And I have no idea why. I don't even remember buying them to be honest because they're not really my style but I'm just little resin flat backs so you get four in that design and then you get two each in this design I mean they're quite pretty with their little flowers on and then you get this 
fiery jack-o'-lantern. You get two, four, six, eight, and you get ten pieces. But it is a mystery to me. When I go to add the links, I'll find them and I'll be like, oh, I did order them. <laughs> Never mind. Right, coming down to the last thing. So the last thing were I bought these keys because I like keys. And I thought they were going to be smaller. But oh no, they're not. They are not small in any way, shape or form. I mean, they're massive. Look at these. I mean, look at these. But they are very nice. You get four in a pack. And they're just plastic keys. But look how pretty they are. They're like uh, Father Christmas keys, aren't they? I might have to do a little tag and attach one and give them to my grandchildren. Even though they've got a chimney. <laughs> but I got four of those. A lot bigger than I expected. But never mind. You could decorate that, put some trim round ribbon, everything else like that. I think they'd be very, very pretty. So there we go. That is the end of this haul so i can't remember what's coming next um i know i've got sheen and a timu so whatever arrives first is what we're going to get first um and i think that's about it i now need to go and have a cup of coffee and i need to go and have some tea and and do all that stuff so <coughs> sorry um, I hope you enjoyed this video. Um, thank you for stopping by, staying with me, listening to me witter on yet again. <laughs> um, and um, please don't forget, like and subscribe, leave me a comment, talk to me. Um, I'm quite happy to talk to you guys. And um, I will, you know, see you in the next video. Self-care. Don't forget about your self-care. You know what I'm saying. Do the things you enjoy. Do the things you love, you know. Take that risk, have an adventure, or just put your feet up and uh, watch a film. All right. So, until next time, take care, everybody, and I will see you in the next video. Bye.